Alright people, welcome back to some more Vitamin Y. So today is Friday. <laughs> this man Daniel is about to have a brain aneurysm. I'm trying to think of what fucking day it is. I do not know how he started making this sound. I said, no, it's not like fucking, you know, Supervise hasn't been freaking on Friday from, like, the beginning, the first episode of I'm Wife Forever fucking Supervise. You know, on Friday. It's always been on Friday. And I'm just like, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what today is. I don't know what tomorrow is. I don't even know where I am. Who am I? Who are you? Where are you doing on my channel? I have a YouTube channel. <laughs> I'm going insane, people. <laughs> anyway, Supervise you bell. Yes. Ah, I have the cards. I have the cards. The deck is literally just sitting there. Like in sh it's just like what uh, Stone Knights were. And even then, that deck's kind of in shambles. I was actually thinking about maybe heading to a regionals with, you know, the ninjas, you know. Same people I went with to YCS Anaheim. Uh, yeah, they're like, hey, you want to go to this regionals in Utah? And I'm just like, yeah, maybe, you know. And you know what deck I'm probably going to, I'm probably going to take Evil Storm again, you know. <laughs> So I go see if how terrible my luck is, you know, it's regional, so it's not, at least it's not like a YCS, it's not as big, it's not as big. Alright, well, instead of just doing that play, I can go Armageddon Knight Foolish, I can go Summoner Monk Fool, uh, literally it's the same play, let's say, Summoner Monk, Pitch, Summon Armageddon Knight, Send, Xing in the Lava Chain, Send, it's two Send, or well, Armageddon Knight, with the Foolish, is two Sends as well, so, overall, not the... Not the most spectacular of plays, you know. I can either get two sends with the Armageddon Knight, or I can get two sends the same way. I'll probably send you Bell, just because I have the call haunted. Hmm, yeah, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and hold on to the monks. That could be useful. So we'll go ahead and send Doom Shaman and you Bell. Yeah. All right. So now we just need some spell cards. <laughs> and uh, Rhoda. All right. Well, get your warrior first. You don't activate Rhoda. Send it to the graveyard, and then to the, you know it has to resolve before you send it to the graveyard. But hey, whatever. So what warrior are you getting? Xaber Pashul. Okay. I guess you're gonna go ahead and set him. I guess. That's fine. Going defensive with X <laughs> with X Sabers against Armageddon Knight. Like, ooh, no? Okay, you don't. That's fine. Direct attack. Read your own cards. Was that a direct attack? No. That was clearly one of my monsters being destroyed in battle. Like, read your own cards. Like, you don't even know your own cards. That's pretty sad. So, you can uh, unclick my hand and go fuck yourself, sir. <laughs> Trying to get something out of my hand. Like, nope, has to be a direct attack, sir. And then your turn. Done. No, there's no aww. If you were freaking read your cards. So, go to main phase 2, continue your play, or end your turn. Like, thank you. Shit. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. Summon Monk, Summon Monk, Pitch the Rota, get Armageddon Knight, Send Tinker, XC into... At this point, I don't even know, everybody's in, in the graveyard now, I guess, sure, Emerald, why not? Yeah, that seems like a fine idea. Alright, Pitch you. Go ahead and Summon you. Backdrop Tinker. Uh, sure, why not? Let's go for Emerald. Why not? Take Dual Slow. 
Uh, ammo. Fact. Detach. Summon back. Then I also summon defense in case that's like a mere force or something. Even if it is, I really don't care. And then just fuck you up. Yeah, see. So yeah. I'll. I'll oh, what is this? Well, when damage thrown while you control X or monster gain, and then inflict the same damage to your opponent, then you could add one. Ew. Ew, what the fuck with this card? Like, oh, so you gain the life points, I take the damage, so I pretty much take the damage and I inflict it to you, which is dumb. And then you get to go ahead and search? Like, what the fuck with this stupid card? Saber Reflect, okay. I guess I'm assuming that's from the Arc 5 character. So I'm assuming that that's his card. Saber Reflect. Oh, X Saber's got some good stuff. Gem Knight's got some good stuff. The fucking Castella character. We would get fucking tw fucking Twinkle or Twilight or whatever. Fucking shitty ass card. Doesn't have to be a Saber. Okay, it could be a Saber. Alright, Bogart Knight. Pashuru. You can go into six. Destroy a number of face up cards on the field. Wow. That's gay. I still don't like fucking X Sabers, not, not at all. They are gross. They jumped the living shit out of you. <laughs> Especially Fault Rural. Like, he, he is the problem. He's fine. He's the problem. He's dumb. <laughs> you summon a 24 beater and then summon another Xaver from your graveyard. Like, what? <laughs> if he attacks me, I can live this. Just wondering if he's going to do anything else. And so you think I'm not going to your synchro monster to pull off this back row? This is a mirror force. Ooh. Bitch, you guess it. But is it worth the risk? Is it worth the risk? Is it worth the risk? Yep. This reminds me of my high school days when I had an opponent who had X Sabers and I would just summon Terror and he'd just be like, aww. <laughs> Who's a tuner? You're, oh, you're a tuner. Okay. You're level 6. You're level 6. Uh, what goblins? What's all those goblins? I think he's level 9, isn't he? I think he is. If he wants to go into Gotham's, Gotham's isn't gonna do much right now. So, <clears throat> but yeah, this 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 card's pretty powerful. Go ahead and search for a, a saber, Gotham spell trap. Like wow, saber spell or trap or Gotham's card from your deck to your hand. Like wow, all because I did damage to you. Like wow, what the fuck. Why, when you <coughs> when you take damage while you control an X Saber, I'm wondering <coughs> you take damage during the damage step and then then it resolves during damage casting and resolves the illusion. I wonder if you can actually do that. I wonder if I just pretty much just let him fucking uh, do that play. I don't know. Yeah, I'm just gonna end. Perfect.
Yeah, they could have won them seven or bouncer. Got about those two. I thought I was thinking about sinkering and then they could have exceeded. Maybe it doesn't have any exceeds. Maybe it's all about the synchro shotgun. Oh, I could do that, but I'll do that next turn. Act. I'll just, uh, you, you keep on saying monsters, I'll keep wiping. Keep on wiping, keep on wiping, and keep nagging, and keep nagging. Nope, destroy our battle. You can get that Emmer's Blade away from me. Your field open, so you don't nag from getting wiped, and then I will go ahead and summon Beals. Bells. Thank you. Activate Silent Doom. Summon Doom Shines. Not really. <laughs> Really? Huh. It could be handled. It's just a good card. Like, look what I have to go through to fucking get that shit. Use my normal summon for tech. <laughs> no blow, like nigga, like you're getting your ass beat. Like I'm gonna go, I'm gonna know something for a fact. I'm gonna take and go for Beal. Like nigga, nigga, you so salty, you salty. That card's OP and you're a noob. Like all right, <clears throat> not my fault. You can't handle power, noob. All right, no, you call him the noob, noob. Like nigga, you're the one that doesn't even know your own fucking shit's a fact. It's okay. You're about to you're about to get you're about to get beat. You're about to lose anyway, so and you shut the fuck up while you're talking to me. Let's get one more dueling. That oh, man. That oh, man. Well, I didn't get any revival, so that's oh my god. Going against Cyber Dragon dot deck. Guess he didn't want to use its effect, so I guess I'll go ahead and go Armageddon Knights and some Doom Shaman. I have the Oasis, so I can summon the Bell for my hand if I last that long. You didn't say effect, so still just level four, which is fine. Go ahead and subs. Doom Shaman. His hand is bad. His hand's really bad. Go ahead and put my mouse over there. Okay. Drawing you bell and terror. Like, awesome. Drawing you bell, not so bad. Drawing terror with it, it's just like, wow. Like, and, and, like, barely any revival. So. Like, I'm just asking to fucking just get my shit wrecked. Alright. No, if I go activate you, summon you, summon you, XC, you have one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Damn. Can't even next time because the fucking oasis is going to stay on the field. Uh, so bad. So bad. And yeah, I'm not getting spells for Summer Monk either. Like, ah! <sighs> oh, I guess I'll just summon another arm again. Night drop Tinker this time. If he didn't have like a, like his hand is already bad enough, but then with him having like some back row with it too, it's just so bad. Like, this is not what I want in this duel. Not at all. Damn, more back row. This duel is gonna be difficult, to say the least. Unless all of his back rows are bluffs. So worried about like summoning Doom Shaman and getting bottomless, but I have to do it. I have to. I have to pretty much commit to summoning Terror so I can get the Ubel out of my hand. I go Doom Shaman, Doom Shaman, summon the Ubel out of my hand. Then End Phase go to Terror, which will neg something more out of my hand. And eventually, like, I'm just gonna have nothing because I have limit reverse. I have the call. I have the plays. It's just look at all that fucking back row. Like, ah, uh, I have to wait away. So, okay. Then I'll go ahead and summon Doom Shaman, get bottomless, and then go ahead and scoop it up. 
Okay, if Doomshopping gets bottomless, I, I just straight up lose. Like, you know, with four pieces of background, I know you have something. Capulse will be bad, bottomless will be bad. There's a lot of cards that would just, you know, suck some nuts, so. Okay, I'm guessing it's fine, because I'm not responding. And then I go on, there we go. I knew it. I was like, if we bottomless, that's it. That's it. That's it. There's no fucking way. My hand was bad and he had the bottomless. Like, there's no fucking way. Once Doom Shaman died in the duel, then my whole deck is turned off. Like, you know? I saw I was so happy when bottomless went down to one. I was like, wow, I'll barely see it. And then number generator was like, oh, never mind. I'm going to see it all the fucking time. <sighs> of course he would have it. Like, oh, uh, it wasn't even a duel. Like, uh, I get one more in. God, that sucks. Draw terror again. Wow, this hand's just as bad. What the fuck? There's no such thing as luck for me. Let me guess you're gonna go ahead and special summon Miss Invincible Bitch, right? Yep. Maybe if I draw an Armageddon Knight or a Dark Greffer. This play is dumb. Like, like oh, one of those monsters can't be targeted by effects and cannot be shrubbed down. Like, damn! Do you think it's a little bit powerful? Like, maybe if she didn't count as a melodious monster. But she does, so it counts for herself, too. It's like, wow. And, she, and he can fucking fuse into that one bitch who banishes my shit? Like... This is gonna be a fucking lose, lose. This is, I'm, I'm probably gonna lose this shit again, especially with this shitty ass hand. Should I just fucking admit defeat now? Like, please, fucking DM. Like, good luck, have fun. Well, luck is definitely not on my side because I can't draw into shit. Like, you know, I run triple Dark Reffer, triple Armageddon Knight, triple uh, Rhoda, Foolish, I, it's just tr double Summoner Monk. Like, I have an ass ton of cards that can fucking help me, and all I'm doing is just drawing into the same goddamn shit. I give up. I give up. I give up. I give up. I fucking give up. Wow. Wow. One more fucking duel, and if this shit doesn't work, I'm gonna fucking kill myself right here. Zubal? What the fuck is Zubal? I guess this is a person named Zubel or Zubel. God, what the fuck? Like seriously? Seriously, like, just 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 allow me to not draw into anything. Like, there's no such thing as luck when it comes to me. That's the reason why I don't want to go to the fucking regionals because I know I have fucking shit ass crap ass, sh fucking booty ass luck. So I'm just gonna fucking lose before I even get a chance. It's like with fucking Anaheim. God, I hate luck in Yu-Gi-Oh. Try this one more time. Sounds better. Still not the best, because there's not much I can do with it. Doom Shaman. Go ahead and drop Tinker. Alright, so next time I can go summon Armageddon and I summon Butter Splice, drop you Bell, Xe into that Emerald, Detach, summon back Doom Shaman. Uh, Doom Shaman. I mean, activate Super Vice, get a fact, summon Tinker. That's in the perfect world where, you know, my opponent can't stop my plays and they don't run any back row. That's in the perfect world, but, you know, in the game of Yu-Gi-Oh, I'm just going to get completely crushed, so. He's going to send this card from his hand to a graveyard to add one level 7 or higher plant type monster. Okay. Okay.
It's a mathematician. It's a carrot like person. Carrot human. Carrot human. Carrot human. If you're running like a plant deck. Nope, nope. Rose lover. Oh, that's what Rose lover does. I think you misclicked. I think you meant to banish. No, you want to send Lone Sign instead. Okay. <coughs> banish the trade in, summon Spell Striker. XC into Malaya. Malaya? Malaya? Yeah. Malaya. Fag. Detach material. Special summon. Globe. I mean, Lone Fire. Lone Fire tribute. So. Go ahead and summon the plant from the deck. A lone fire, a lone fire tripping itself again. Some lone fire from the deck. Lone fire tripping itself with like <sighs> so dumb. So lone plant princess. Titania, alright. Main phase two, set an ass ton of back row. My kingdom for MST right now. <laughs> oh, I can go extremely off. I can go silent doom summon doom chum supervised tinker. I, I could go off right now. In the first turn, when a card effect that targets a card in the field is activated, you contribute one face of play once again. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Well, it's bottomless, it's bottomless. I want to kill, I need to kill both of these guys because they're both going to go so plus that I pretty much need to take them both out. You're more important to take out than you. So I think I might just go Silent Doom summon, you know, XE and like Beals. I mean, Synchro and the Beals. Save the Supervise. Ah, fuck it. I'm going to go Ham. I'm Doom. Fuck it. Let's see if it's bottomless or something along those lines. I mean, his deck is down to like fucking 27 cards, like that's fucking amazing. Oops, turn one card effect that targets a card on the field. Alright, well, this doesn't target, it just equips. Wait, does equips target? I think they do. Equip. Uh, yeah. Any tribute? Equips target. Yeah, I think it does. Oh, never mind. You just have the MST. That's fine. Fine. Use my normal summon for act. Act. Card, do I want to sound doom? Of course, I want to sound doom. Always want to sound doom. And kill this bitch. So, oh, no more. No more of that plussy plussy. Miracle fertilizer. Plants up so much shit. <laughs> Teddy is level eight. Yeah, titani titanial. Or that bitch off a of fairy tale. <laughs> uh, I stopped watching that anime a while ago. I just 
I stopped liking it. <laughs> I don't even know what I saw in it in the first place. <laughs> At least this duel's better. Kinda sucks that I got my shit MSD, but you know what? I'm totally fine with it in the MSD. Power of Crane Crane. Crane Crane's so powerful. Probably one of the reasons why Sangan got banned, because Crane Crane plus Sangan. It's like Tour Guy, it's like just powerful. Not so level threes. Alright. Some another spell striker. Mm-hmm. See into another Malay. Summon another Lone Fire. Lone Fire tributes. I don't know the other Lone Fire. God, there's so much I have to handle. Your effects negated, so I don't care about you. Trying to figure out what he's planning. Go ahead and summon one fire. Is there any other target you can summon? Oh, you can summon you. Hmm. Yep, I saw that. I'm like, you can summon her. With that 28 booty. The opponent cannot target face up plant type monsters for attacks in this one. Okay, so I gotta kill her first before I do anything. Ooh, Rhoda. Guess you're gonna go ahead and search for another spell, oh, spell striker. Okay. And then you can banish the Rhoda to just start summoning spell striker. XCE into another melee with the Lone Fire. Detach, special summon back the Lone Fire. Lone Fire. Yep, he's about to get all the plant princesses. Ew! <laughs> Only problem is that you really can't do his beals. All oh, right, he can poke me directly for six hundred. Go into another melee, melee detach, summon back. Oh no! I'm gonna quit. Okay. So I guess I'll just keep on going into Bills as this. So once per turn during your player's turn, you can touch on the same attack from this card and target one face up attack position monster you control. Then change the defense position if you do control, blah, 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 blah. Alright, I'm summoning another Bills. I'm going to kill you. You're going to summon another plant princess except for her, which is fine. And then I'll probably kill you. Yeah, that seems like a fun idea. Oh no, because you can turn the defense to block with Mikwit Bane and Ganeer. Ah, okay. Activate you. You use my normal summon for summon for fact that God, I wish I had you bell in the graveyard right now. So let's keep on going into bills. Wait, do I want to go into that? No, what? No, no, I can go into hot. I can go into hot. Turn it to the targets of card on the field, alright, no, you don't do anything. Yeah, I'm gonna go into hot. Only hot can attack, but, yeah, hot. Do I want a dark refer? No, definitely not. <laughs> alright. What do you want to save? Okay. Target. Okay. Alright. And as I say, once per turn until the end of this turn. Once per turn, turn it for six, then target one of the turns into the If you do, it cannot be destroyed by Bob or Carpex this turn. Alright.
Well, you're really not doing anything on the field right now. And is there any other plant princess that I gotta be worried about? I should just get rid of you. Just have to say plant. Just... Yep, just summon a plant type monster. Alright. Eels can attack, only hot can. So I'm assuming they're gonna go ahead and go melee, detach, summon back up, and probably her. See, I'm, 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 I have, I'm in control of this duel. It says if he gets rid of his field, then I'm fucked. Because I got nothing right now. You know? I got these two, which can, you know, turn into like an Exiton or a 101 or something. Yep, on fire. On fire to itself. Or no, it should be dandy. Get your two tokens, summon. Okay. Okay, I see what you, I see where you going with this, homie. Like I said, once I summon these 3,000 monsters, your plant princesses, they're like, oh, your monster's so big and sexy, can't get over <laughs> Okay, Giga Plant. He seriously does have some powerful plays, though. You could summon another level six, go and look at him. Like, nope, nope, Spore. All right. Go into that Black Rose card, Moonlight Rose. Yep, how'd I know? How'd I fucking know? Love Lord Dandy's tokens. One, alright. One, two, three, four. Hmm. Knew it. I was like, he's gonna go for that fucking Black Rose Moonlight Dragon. <laughs> so, and if he gets rid of my entire field, then I can literally just go into an Exodon. Alright, so I go to level four. So you can go this with this and go for another one if you have it. Oh, never mind. You can only use this effect of Moonlight Dragon once per turn. Oh, it's going into 8. His own hot. Okay. I was kind of dumb, but sure. Because now you're going to wipe your own shit. Oh, symbol of heritage. That's a game. That's fucking game. That's fucking game, because Lone Fire's not once per turn, so literally he's gonna summon a plant, crash, attack, attack, attack. That's game. Wow. Wow. I should have fucking survived. Oh my god. Fucking luck. Like, are you fucking shitting me? I had to use every single card in his hand. Like, I hate when I lose because my opponent has everything. Like,. If they were just missing one card, like, that's ridiculous. That's it. Wow. Symbol of fucking heritage. And didn't I put fucking it at the bottom? I said at the bottom, but I'd probably do the same thing. Like, no, that wasn't GG. Fucking sack the shit out of me. Like, you fucking shitting me. This is Lone Fire, Lone Fire, Lone Fire, Symbol of Heritage, Number Generating Piece of Shit. Like, oh my god. I should have won that duel. Wow, where are my fucking revival cards? Ridiculous. You're lucky I didn't get more revival. You are. You're so lucky. Oh my god. Why? Why does everybody have luck and I have none? Like, I hate, I hate that shit. Why? Why? Uh, I want some luck. Can I get some luck? I'm, I'm like the world's most unlucky person. <sighs> I'm calling it up to, this is a terrible video. I couldn't even get like one victory in. 
So I hope you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with Cyberdike, you Bill. Thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.